Welcome everyone. Again, my name is Lazaro J. Diaz, and this is the VLAN Access Lab and NAT course. Now, it's a big name for the course, but with every right to have that big name because this is gonna be this this course is a huge lab, is what it is. Okay? With the rest of these uh, lectures are gonna be through the, on the desktop using the packet tracer. And it's gonna guide you through a series of different commands and configurations that uh, encompass different concepts in the CCNA certification. Now, I don't know if you can barely see this. I mean, not to worry, you're gonna see it inside the, uh, in the next lecture when we start actually going into the CCNA, into the Cisco packet tracer. What we have here are one, two, three, four, five switches, VLAN 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. And over here we have a core switch, which is gonna be VLAN 2. And you can see you have a DHCP server and a TFTP. You have two routers and one external web server. All right, that's what the lab is going to consist of. And of course, we have uh, different IP settings because every VLAN is its own subnet. Therefore, we're going to have different subnets in each one. But the key to this lab, or one of the concepts that we're going to discuss, is that you're going to have PCs, host clients, attached to these uh, switches and they're gonna receive an address from the DACP server. Now, we know networking. We know that that cannot be possible across a broadcast domain unless you do certain things. One, put another DACP server. Two, uh, put a DACP relay agent, or we can also configure the router as a DACP, or we can use the IP helper address, which is what we're gonna do in the lab. We're also gonna go ahead, so that means that you're gonna be configuring VLANs on these switches. You're gonna be assigning the VLANs, and you're also going to go ahead over here and trunk the ports for everybody. So, and then we're going to secure the network using access lists on the routers, and then finally use NAT and back up everything to a TFTP server. So this is going to be a huge lab, okay, encompassing all these concepts. It doesn't matter, okay, that if you didn't take any courses before, there are step-by-step -step guidelines. You have a Word document that's going to give you step-by-step -step on what you need to do. You have an Excel spreadsheet that gives you the breakdown of the IPs. But I'm going to guide you through the whole thing step-by-step. -step. Not a big deal. It's going to be a fun lab. It's going to be a very interesting lab because it encompasses all these different uh, concepts. Okay? So, again, I'm just getting you ready. I'm going to explain everything again. Once we get into the Cisco Packet Tracer, you're going to learn how to use it a little bit more. And you're going to be configuring all sorts of different things. Okay? So get ready. Download all the stuff that you need. And I'll see you in the next lecture.